I'm going to be bringing in another commentary. So this game is quite epic and quite funny at the same time. So <clears throat> after being on for a while, none of my friends were on. I was like, oh, I'm going to run a solo of PUBG. But anyways, once I joined, Jay Mountain ends up joining and another buddy. So right when I started this game, everybody got on. And then, of course, they wanted to start one you know as a as a group right because i don't really care for playing this game solo very much it's not really fun so i landed at those apartments and then i decided i'm going to be really aggressive this around until i die you know of course i wanted to die this match so i could jump in with them kind of thing if you know what i mean but as you guys can see how many people headed to school and then i just head there that guy had me dead right and i still killed him i don't know how so it was kind of like Every gunfight I got into, I would win, and it was quite an entertaining gameplay because I was playing very aggressive. I wasn't backing down from anybody. I was I didn't really care what my position was. You know, I was just playing this just to die pretty much to start up a game. But anyways, I end up winning and I end up getting quite a few kills, you guys will see, and th my controller is broken. So I won this game with a con broken controller if you guys don't know my left analog stick is always going up and I can't stop it so when I'm reviving somebody it always cancels it or if um, like sometimes I have problems sprinting uh, you know I really have to press down on the left d-pad to or left analog stick to really get it to work and it's quite annoying I need to get a new controller but you know my controller is messed it messes up your aim once in a while and stuff like that you know because you're never standing still you know when you're trying to snipe or whatever you're never really still unless you hold it back so it's kind of annoying I need to get a new controller but this game man like this is my second time that I wanted to that uh, I was playing very aggressive and ended up doing very well uh, <laughs> it just seems like when you play very aggressive people don't expect it and and yeah you end up getting the lead on them because they just don't expect players to play like that but that's just the way it is I guess I don't I don't I don't know it's that or luck I have no idea but yeah this this match I just wanted to die you guys seen how many people landed landed at school I didn't hear that many gunfights whatsoever so I thought I was gonna head over there and you know get in more trouble than that but I could only find two people in school I ended up circling around a bunch of times didn't find anybody so and nobody landed with apartments with me but you guys will see see this guy jumps out and then I'm gonna contest him I got a motorbike he has a buggy and look at he almost kills me but my last bullet it seems like got a headshot on him like I just got away with 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 things I shouldn't have got away with you know what I mean so <laughs> like that guy had me dead to right as well he could have started shooting me like right when I stopped I mean he had the aim out on me but he didn't he didn't want to contest I guess until I jumped out but then I only had a motorbike for cover and he had a buggy and I still melted him I don't know how I don't know how but just pure luck this game and here I am just you know in the middle of the street not caring in the middle of school and apartments like just don't even care right now you guys will see I will kill somebody else that will roll up on me and then you guys will see somebody in school I don't know where he came from because nobody landed at apartments with me so he must have came from the school to the apartments but I never saw him so it was quite weird and I will ignore that guy because I was trying to figure out where he was but I have no idea you guys will probably see a little bit of that uh, coming up here shortly but it was just it was just a fun game man like I was just like you know I was just stoked this entire round like uh, oh my god I dropped another one dropped another one do you guys find that you guys have better luck when you guys want to die than <laughs> than uh, for you players that want to win let me know because you know it would be nice to know see this guy rolls up on me and this I'm just gonna hit fire this guy but uh <laughs> You know, like, why did he even stop, man? I had him there, but, you know, he just, like, I'm going to contest. Kind of like something I would do right now, but, yeah. I, I, I don't know why I even contested. And as you guys can hear, I'm taking shots from the school, or from apartments somewhere. And I don't know 
where exactly it's coming from. So I will head to my left to get in the circle uh, because I, I looked around for this guy and I had no idea where he was. I was thinking maybe roof, maybe in one of those windows, but I have no idea where the shots were coming from, so I just ignored him. I thought that if I go to this circle and then I turn on him then it would be a different story because he would have to run towards the circle but I never saw him and this guy's getting shot up and I was wondering where that was coming from and you guys will see look at this look at this guy look at this snake right there he's crawling in the grass desperate desperate it's quite funny actually and this game man I tell you so I looted one guy I was looking for uh, five five six, I think, and Buddy didn't have any five five six. No, I was looking for seven six two, and Buddy didn't have any seven six two. All he had was five five six. So I go ahead and I loot this guy, and all he has is seven six or sorry five five six. So I will have to switch guns in the middle of a battle. You guys will see and then carry on my way and then I was running out of 556 five, and then I go to loot the other guy that I killed and then he only had 762 oh my talk about luck man talk about luck you guys can see here I'm looking around there was gunshots coming from that direction somewhere I have no idea where it was coming from so you know I see this guy hauling ass and I'll kill him and then right here I didn't notice I had a phone call and I ended up answering the phone but I had no idea the circle was coming in I didn't know I had to go so I will get on my way because uh, I just was not paying attention to the circle whatsoever I don't know what's up with that but I just wasn't paying attention all right but I end up getting back in and you guys will see a kill right here so how suspicious is this doom buggy and a bush right next to it hmm I wonder where the player is there he is, hiding in the bush, of course. Like I said, guys, if a bush looks suspicious, make sure you guys be careful because people blend into bushes really well. But if you guys want to sit in a bush, don't park your car right next to it. It's kind of giving away your position, thoughts. But anyways, yeah, I was looking for 762 right here, and as you guys can see, he didn't have any. So all he had was 556, and so I had to switch guns. So no big deal. I'll switch guns right here, and man, I love this M4, man. I, the M4 in this game is probably one of the best guns in this game, especially with like a two-time, or especially if you got a suppressor on it. It just does work. I love that gun. It's probably my favorite gun in this game uh, besides the Car 98 because uh, I love the Car 98. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. Sometimes you're right on target. Sometimes you don't get the hits for it, but... You know, when you do get the hits for it, I mean, sniping in this game is—it's always—it's always such a great feeling to get to get somebody with a one shot. It's—it's—it's—it's it's, it's, it's awesome. I mean, and I could drop any time here. I mean, really, I only got a level two helmet, so one car ninety-eight shot would take me out. And look where the circle ends up, man. The circle's in the in the mansion area where it's all forest. I've never seen the circle here before. And, uh, you know, I, I thought I was going to definitely die here from somebody sitting in a bush or sitting sitting behind a tree or something. So when I was this when I was this close to winning the game, I was just decided I'm going to play a little bit safer, but still play aggressive at the same time. So I seen a guy there was shooting at that at that building earlier. That's why I know that there's still somebody over there. So I was keeping my eyes open and you, you guys will see he'll head right towards me and then I'll, of course, kill him. But. See, here he comes, right towards me. I think he goes for a little jump. And he turns around, like doesn't even know where I am. The suppressors in this game is, are just nuts. You know, the suppressors, you can never tell where the shots are coming from correctly. It's, it's, I love suppressors in this game, if, if you have one. I don't like really going against them very much because, you know, then I don't know where their position are. But right here man I heard mad footsteps and I was like where is this guy he's probably heading to the circle but I don't know exactly where he is I mean I'm looking for him looking for him and I was just like hey I'm just gonna sit here for a bit make sure my grenades on I don't know exactly where he is like I have no idea but I heard the footsteps so you know he was definitely close to me but I don't I didn't see him so I thought he was to my left but he was actually right there right to my right I did not even see that guy 
if he saw me he would have killed me but anyways right here as you guys can see I'm not low on ammo but I needed ammo you know what I mean like I'm in one of those spots where I need ammo but you know so here I am I'm gonna loot this guy for a 556 and he doesn't have any all he has is 762 oh my god these 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 mm, these players in this game I tell you <laughs> Pick up different ammo. I mean, I always pick up 762 and 762 or 762 and 556, even if I don't have spot uh, or if I don't need any of those ammo because it's just taking away from all the other players, if that makes any sense. So I kind of hold those two for sure. Uh, nine millimeter rounds and stuff like that, I could care less about. There, there was a guy in this building here. I'll try to pop a couple shots at him, but nothing ever comes of it. Uh, he was on the top floor. He, I didn't get any hits on him or anything, but I shot at him a couple times. Nothing happened, so I decided four left. I'm going to head to the circle, try to get in a good position, but I'm still not going to, you know, just lay here. I'm still going to get up and, and try to find these guys because when it comes to last circle, a lot of people do just lay down, but all it takes is one player to spot a uh, little darkness in the grass and then you're automatically dead like you won't have time to react so you're better off actually on your feet on last person if if you know what i mean i mean unless you unless it's tall grass then you're better off probably laying down but if it's just grass like this i mean you're going to be noticeable uh as is but as you guys can see i've seen that guy so and i thought there was three left but there was only two and i was unaware that this was the last guy for the win um, but as you guys can see, I try to nade him out. Nothing happens. I just shoot him with the gun as he's trying to lay down there. <laughs> but anyways, yeah, 10 kills, guys. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Hope you guys enjoy. It was an aggressive game. Until next time, peace.